Walmart is crashing in front of our eyes. In an era rife with economic uncertainty, Walmart, the emblematic giant of retail and an embodiment of American consumerism, faces an unparalleled crisis. The once muted whispers of an impending recession now resound ominously, and in this tumultuous landscape, Walmart's formerly unassailable empire seems to be crumbling silently. While a mere 1% drop in earnings might rattle most companies, recent reports depict a far graver scenario. For decades, Walmart reigned as the quintessential exemplar of retail prowess, setting the benchmark for all competitors. However, the latest data and statistics weave a narrative distinct from its celebrated history, one of an immense retailer grappling with the relentless currents of an ever-changing world. Join us on this exploration with Finance Today as we unveil the mystery surrounding Walmart's decline. Delve into the pivotal numbers, compelling facts, and emerging trends signaling this monumental transformation in the commerce realm. Number 1. Ominous Sales Outlook on September 29th, 2022, Walmart made an announcement that sent shockwaves through the financial world. The retail giant shared a disheartening sales outlook for the final quarter of 2022. Walmart predicts a substantial decline in profit margins, primarily due to the rising costs of everyday necessities. With these essential items eating up more of consumers' budgets, there is less money left for discretionary spending, such as clothing. To counter this, Walmart will be forced to cut prices across a wide range of products in an attempt to clear inventory that isn't moving. Number 2. Profit Margin Woes Adding to the woes, Walmart also disclosed that it expects its adjusted earnings per share to plummet by 9% in the current quarter compared to the same period the previous year. This sharp decline serves as a stark reminder of the company's ongoing financial troubles. Number 3. Market Reaction Financial markets reacted swiftly and harshly to Walmart's announcement. In a single day, the company's shares nosedived by an alarming 8%. Although there has been a slight recovery since then, Walmart's stock still lingers close to the lows of a consolidation pattern, indicating persistent investor concern. Number 4. Stock Performance a deeper look at Walmart's stock performance reveals troubling trends. It continues to trade below its 50-day moving average, a clear sign of ongoing struggles. Furthermore, it remains below the more extended 200-day moving average, indicating sustained challenges that the company is grappling with. Number 5. Steepest Decline the month of May marked a significant low point for Walmart. Shares of the retail giant experienced their most substantial one-day decline ever, plummeting by a staggering 11.7% in response to the release of its first quarter earnings report. Number 6. Declining Profits Data from Gap shows a shocking 24% year-over-year decline in profit per diluted share. Number 7. Cash Flow Crisis Beyond the challenges of dwindling profits, Walmart faces an even more alarming predicament. It generated no cash from operations during the past quarter. Instead, it consumed a staggering $3.8 billion. When coupled with $3.5 billion in capital spending, Walmart's free cash flow for the third quarter was an alarming negative $7.3 billion. Number 8. Earnings Shortfall A closer examination of Walmart's earnings reveals a significant shortfall compared to investor expectations. Over the past three quarters, the company's earnings have fallen by an average of 4.5%. Number 9. Inventory Glut 
Walmart's woes have been further exacerbated by a massive inventory glut. The company engaged in heavy spending to build inventory in the first half of the year, a strategy that has now backfired. Elevated inflation compounded the problem as the more expensive items purchased in anticipation of demand failed to sell at the expected rate. Number 10. Soaring Grocery Prices one of Walmart's core principles has always been providing low prices to its customers. However, even this giant is now grappling with the impact of soaring grocery prices. CEO Doug McMillan expressed deep concerns about double-digit inflation in the food sector. Grocery prices at Walmart have already risen by a staggering 21% between July 2019 and July 2022. Well, my curious viewers, here's one interesting question for you. Why did Walmart go to therapy? Because it had too many issues with its check balance. Don't forget to subscribe to Finance Today. Let's continue. Number 11, The Dawn and Dusk of Price Wars. Walmart, for decades, was the undisputed champion of Price Wars, a retail juggernaut that drove mom-and-pop stores out of business. Its rise to supremacy was marked by an unwavering commitment to offering the lowest prices. However, in recent years, the tables have turned. The company's financial sheets now bear the weight of real estate expenses, an Achilles heel that e-commerce giants evade entirely. Number 12. The Super Center Conundrum once, Walmart supercenters were the pinnacle of retail convenience. However, changing consumer preferences have disrupted this paradigm. Shoppers increasingly favor convenience stores over one-stop behemoths, resulting in a 3% decline in same-store sales for Walmart supercenters during the third quarter. Foot traffic in Walmart's U.S. stores also dwindled by 2.1%. Value and convenience are the new retail gods, and Walmart must adapt or risk obsolescence. Number 13. Shrinking Seasonal Hires as the holiday season approaches, a time when Walmart traditionally beefs up its workforce, there's an unexpected shift. Seasonal hiring at the retail giant has plummeted by a staggering 73%. In stark contrast to 2021, when the company added 150,000 associates, this year saw only 40,000 seasonal staff members brought on board. In conclusion, Walmart's struggles are not isolated but intertwined with the evolving American retail landscape and broader economic trends. While the giant may be on a downward trajectory, it remains a pivotal player in the retail arena. However, its future hinges on its ability to adapt to changing market dynamics. Did you enjoy the video? Then give it a like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to Finance Today and press the bell icon to never miss a video from us. Bye-bye!